Hello guys and welcome back to TNT Madness. Today I'm going to show you guys something I think is relatively awesome and that is uh, TNT powered combo lock. So this is a normal simple combo lock. You got your nine digit input. Uh, the password is this, just one, two, three, four. And if you press the button you can go in because that's the right com combination. Okay, so if you do get the combination wrong, however, it, let's say I go one, two, three, four, five and press the button, then the door is not going to open and then everything around me going to blow up. Okay guys, so if we take a quick look at this thing, we've got the inputs at the front here, but then if we go around to the back here, we can see all the redstone, and as I said, we've got a simple combo lock, except I have a extra two-way gate that leads to the TNT down the bottom. So this is all the redstone that creates the effect of the combo lock, it's very small, and as you can see, under the platform, we have a giant large block of TNT encased in redstone glass. So this thing is actually really good for what it does, in my opinion. It can be extremely secure for what you want it to do, but the downside is if even you get it wrong, that can be problematic. But anyway, I think this is really awesome, and now let's take a look at, the, take a closer look at the red stuff. Okay guys, so to start off with, we've got this simple combo lock thing, it's actually very simple. All you need is a pad that has redstone out the front here, and these redstone torches are where your numbers are, so if you want it to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, you would just place a torch here, and get rid of that redstone. And the places where you don't want the numbers to be, it'd just be redstone. And the whole point of this is to get all this redstone so it's off, and that way we'll invert this torch and turn it on and go into this two-way gate. The, when you're ready to activate the two-way gate, you will activate this redstone here, which will then go over and activate this redstone over here. So if you're wondering what this piston is, all it is used for is when you place down this lever, and you have someone outside, and they're trying to get in while you're inside your base, they can't, and they can't blow up your base either. So it's very useful for that. So after you have got this input here, it then goes through this torch into this very small RS null latch. And what that is, is pretty much, uh, if you have m more than one input here, it just stays on this input here. So if I press this button over here, it'll go onto the other input, which is the unlocked door. And if I press this button here, it'll lock the door. And that's why we have this button here, which resets everything. So after that, we have got this torch down here, which just goes down into the door over there. So what happens now is that's your simple combo lock. So what we have now is we've got this extra bit of redstone going into a second two-way gate, and all it is is 12 ticks, so that way when you press the button uh, and you change over the thing, uh, it gives you enough time for this to change over to unlocked mode so this torch is on, and then this torch will go off and turn on very quickly. But if you do get it wrong, this thing will stay off and that will go off, and then this will activate this down here, and then you'll be able to, then it will go down into this giant block, box of TNT and blow up everything. So obviously I'm not going to be doing a tutorial for this, but it is a pretty awesome concept and it is pretty awesome that you can make. And it's actually as compact as I've made it. I've made this like five times, but it's mostly a concept. You can actually do this TNT thing with any kind of combo lock, whether it's 2x2 two two button, if it's 9 digit lever like I have here, or if it's like a 3x3 three three button. You can do it for all of that. But anyway, there'll be a download in the description below. And yeah, so that's this whole thing done. And also, more good news, I am actually making a second TNT Madness channel, like TNT Madness 2. There's not going to be too much on it, it's mostly going to consist of vlogs and just me playing different game types. It's probably going to be relatively boring to people that like my polished main channel videos, but if you like stuff that is just more personal, and more in life, and more just of game playing, then I'm pretty sure you will enjoy it. But I'm not going to be having a link in to that channel until probably a week from now, till I actually get the whole thing sorted. I've got the logo and channel art sorted, but I'm still working on a separate intro for it and all that. So anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and if you want to see more, please hit that like button and notice that you appreciate my content. And if you want to see two videos a week, one including TNT Powered Redstone, and the other including the weekly... Um, TNT cannons I do, then hit that subscribe button. But anyway, goodbye from TNT Magic.